Welcome back to Mother 3. We've made our way up the tower far enough to get into this room. Yep. So let's see. Oh, damn, for some reason I, I thought this was the vending machine. Okay, whatever, let's do this, bitch. Stop that. Oh shit. Hate it when that happens.
only there was an item that let me restore health to everybody. Damn it! Sorry about that. Yeah, I'm looking kind of fucked here unless it's really close to death. Mm. I, mean, I just don't want to waste all my items on this fight, you know? Oh, there it is. that Lucas won't get any of this good experience. Duster's gonna out, it's gonna be uh, ahead of him on level, which is whatever. Maybe I should've used one of those herbs on Lucas there at the end. I used one on him, but I, didn't, I was scared to use another.
You reap what you sow, so sue, so, so. Greetings, cheese popsicle. The number you have dialed is currently out of fortune. From east to west it goes, goes. Broken, broken. Oh, so, so, so broken. Good rinse. Give me this yo yo. Lucas got a friend's yo yo. Pony and Duster are now ahead of Lucas in levels. Now, who should I give? I think if, I, I'm thinking about giving this to the Duster. Because he kind of needs it. It's only plus 10 offense for Lucas. Oh, wait. I gotta give it to him. I'm surprised that all my human characters can use the friend Jojo. I, I kind of would have thought that would have been something only Lucas can use because this yo-yo is obviously, I, I think it's supposed to be referencing Nessus yo-yo and Earthbound, so. I don't know, I just kind of felt like it'd be something only Lucas would be able to use because of that. Give that to Duster. Lucas kind of didn't need the speed, though. Somehow he's became my, he's become my slowest character. I guess he always was, actually. But, but yeah. Now Duster's right there on offense. I need to buy a lot of these. Oh, it has a bunch of shit in here. Oh, damn. I, I thought I was only gonna be able to get one thing out of there. Give me all my money right now. How many healing items do I have left at this point? Lucas has a lot. Luxury banana. Too bad, it's so expensive. It's just the luxury banana is just so expensive. It just I just can't justify buying it.
This is strong against lightning. I feel like that's very important actually. Very important for a little later. I think everybody should have. <coughs> I think everybody should have a, a, a luxury banana. Ah! What's done is done. Did not need to do this again, but here we are. We can beat Miss Robot Lady. We can beat you.
Hurry up! Oh my god, hurry up! Uh... Oh, we killed it! Damn! You aren't shit, after all. Yeah, I was trying to hurry up and get to Lucas's turn so we could heal Boney. I wasn't gonna make it though. But luckily, Kumatora had the finishing blow. Great, then my selection will be. Is this just earthbound music? It's gotta be, right? Start to feel feverish. These are the only two songs you'll play? One more time. Alright, give it to me. Counter. Flex physical damage to one ally. Some attacks can't be reflected, however. But like any physical damage that's coming towards Lucas, it goes to an ally instead? What? I need to use PK. I keep forgetting Lucas has this. And it, it, it still might just be better than his regular attacks. I need to use it more often for sure. Give me, yeah, give me a little bit of walking around money, I suppose. Look, look at all the money I got just by beating that thing. I really am loving this game, y'all. Especially now, especially right here, right now, with being able to have four party members. That's when this game is at its most fun. It, it kind of seems like, and don't get me wrong, the first, the first three chapters are still fun. I just think they could have been even better if you had your hands on more party members throughout them. 
but they're still very memorable and very uh very enjoyable so uh but that is probably my biggest personal critique with the game is I wish you, you could have been able to have more party members in the first three chapters. You encounter Short Circuit Zap in his cohort. Got the teeth on these things look out of place on these creatures. It's like the teeth on these things, like these apps are just so like these zap dudes, they're like so cartoony, but then the, the teeth just kind of pop on them. It makes the teeth look kind of realistic. It's weird. Weak against ice. And strangeness. How you like that? Thunder! I didn't hit anyone. Haha! -ha. Fuck you. Haha, -ha, get fucked. Wasting some of Lucas's PP at this point. Let's use an use an item because this big city cola is getting it, it, like I don't think it's going to be very useful in any battle anymore because 30 HP is just not enough to heal in the in the middle of the battle. HP of damage is becoming very normal for uh, enemies to to inflict on me. Electrical discharges. Get him. I couldn't buy any PP restoring items in that vending machine thing. No way.
I guess none of those status effects lingered. Huh. Hey, Lucas! Are you alright? PK Flash! Causes all enemies to cry, can also cause strangeness, paralysis, and instant defeat. Hmm. For some reason, Kumatora started to feel feverish. Maybe it'll be, uh, PK Freeze. Beta. Approximately 2 to 8 PP from one enemy. Okay, that's useful. And it costs 0 PP. So that's great. Seven, all right. Suspicious individuals detected inside generator room. Activating defense system. Repeat! Activating defense system. All oh, personnel, it would be nice if you'd evacuate immediately. Shouldn't have sold that. Saltwater gun. Thank you. 
I'll go for it. Why don't these have descriptions? Is that like a glitch in the game? Stop crying. Maybe that means it can't attack me back when I hit it. Perhaps it is wishful thinking. No, it does. Yikes. Bullshit. Fucking horse ass shit. Maybe now it, 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 it can't attack me back. It sure can't.
Didn't work that time. Now this one's not saying a description. What the fuck is up with that?
Clay Powder didn't cure numbness, did it? I felt like I had something that cured numbness. I'm looking it up. I guess uh, Duster can even heal. He can do shit, I guess, then damn. <laughs> Man, this thing is. I didn't mean to use it on fucking Lucas, damn it! Shit! Fuck! Well, Duster could do that, I guess. There we go. There it is. Killed him with the, uh, with the special, what the fuck was it again? Yo, yo, this, yeah, the special yo, yo. Experience for everybody. A serious error has occurred in the generator. A serious error has occurred in the generator. All personnel, evacuate immediately. Repeat, it would be nice if you'd evacuate immediately. You, how dare you destroy this vital system of ours. Hmm, I guess this is a case of fools like smoke. Enjoy heights. <laughs> Do not get that at all.
there's another, another boss fight waiting for me up here. If there isn't, I'll waste that beef jerky, but that's okay. <laughs> you pathetic fools. There's nowhere to run now. <laughs> You've been a real thorn in our side, you know that? What's funnest of all is that happiness could have been yours. What's, what's funniest of all is that happiness could have been yours. Had you simply stayed in Tasmili and lived quietly, without a care in the world. God, how many bananas do you have on you? Alright, it's all set then. I'll be done here soon. So leave the mother pork ship on standby uh, up above. You said it. You said the title of the game. Thunder Tower is no longer usable. But this is the perfect chance to eliminate the whole lot of you in one fell swoop. It's a bit much for three lousy rats, but our king just loves being flashy. So I've decided that you and Thunder Tower can disappear flashily together. Well, looks like my ride is here. Later days, pals. Okay, all set. Destroy Thunder Tower. Well, Lucas, we haven't known each other long, but it's been fun. I'll never forget about you guys. <laughs> you fool. <laughs> All right, let's grab onto it. Rope Snake, you're up. Is that? They're trying to shake us off. Lucas, Kumatora, Boney, hold on tight now. Doster, it's me, the rope snake. I know this isn't the best time to chat, but I have some good news for me. And that news for you. The good news for me is that although we had news each other long, I now. I'm now made the cat in store. Thanks to you. And the bad news to you is that my doll is a sturdy enough to support the weight of three people and one dog. In other words, my doll is at its limit. This is literally jaw rotten. You know, I think I kind of like to think that the person uh, saying this is the uh, is the speaker in Hunter Hunter. Moving puppets made from clumps of earth, a tower that can fire thunderbolts on demand, an extensive highway system, ships that fly through the sky. The enemy that Lucas and his companions must stand up against has grown to such an enormous scale. Do they even stand a chance against this vile and powerful nemesis? No common sense must be ignored in a solution in a situation like this. 
Even if there is only a one in a billion chance of victory, that means there is also a one in a billion opportunity of turning the tables completely. Will Lucas, Kumatora, and Duster be separated once again, or will they work together again to overcome the obstacles that stand in their way? From the flying ship, a masked man looked down upon Lucas and friends, his profile still very youthful. The tale now moves to its next chapter. With almost certain promise of battles far more intense than ever before. Yeah, Hunter Hunter. The one that started in 2011. Yeah, the version, the version of that anime that started in 2011. Pretty damn good anime. My second favorite, in fact, behind Naruto. Naruto's mostly got the nostalgia factor in its favor, but I just, I've yet to watch another anime that I can put ahead of Naruto. I'm not as in to, an I'm not as into anime as I am video games, but, but I dabble with anime. Anyway, the frog is asking to record what's happened so far. Yes, yes you can. Thank you very much. And what a great place to end the episode. Until next time.